Welcome, students. Welcome back to the Right Enrollment Series brought to you by Veronica Garcia and Ramon Cabrales. Today, we're going to be going over Chapter 5, Navigating the New Student Orientation. We have one of our special guests, one of our top advisors from Wright College, George Beard. George, thank you for being here. I appreciate you helping our students. How are you doing? I'm great. Thanks for having me, Ramon. I appreciate it. Great. great. Are you ready? to give? Us I am ready. So I'm going to walk the students through how to access the new student orientation. Um, so students, brand new students, everybody's going to be added to the orientation automatically once they enroll uh, at, or excuse me, once they register, excuse me, once they apply at Wright College. Uh, new students, if they log in to my.ccc.edu, they'll come to this homepage. And one of the first things that they possibly will see is the new student tasks. In the, new students in the new student tasks, there is an orientation section, but we want our new students to know that this is gonna be updated to reflect our new process. And that's why I'm gonna walk them through how to access the new student orientation online. It starts with that online component and the wording here will say that eventually. But in the meantime, what students can do to access the online orientation, they can come to the homepage, scroll down to the quick access, they'll click on the quick access, a, t a tile there and from there they're going to click on the Brightspace, the D2L Brightspace which is our course management system at the City Colleges. There will be two classes in their Brightspace once they start out. One is going to be the online English test, English placement test and the other is going to be our orientation. So if they're ready to start the orientation students will click here um, on that picture of our students. They can come into the class, they can read the announcements, they get a little prep of what's coming. There's gonna be six different modules in the online orientation. And once they're ready to begin, they'll click on content. And that should take them to the first module. And they'll see a picture of a student here, a few more directions on how to navigate through the orientation. A whole bunch of directions here. And they'll click on this, the welcome from the president to get going started on the modules and working their way through them. So as I said, there's six different modules. Once the students make it through and there's a final quiz at the end that has five questions, which they need to get correct. So pay attention when you guys are going through the orientation. A congratulations will pop up saying, great, you're done with our online component. And then there's gonna be a link to sign up for a registration session where they can meet with college advisors and begin picking their first set of classes. So that is the online component. Great, thank you, George. Appreciate it. Great information. Uh, and this students will actually lead into chapter six, which is? Navigating the new student orientation and registration sessions. So please, um, we will see you guys back for chapter six, uh, where we will show you guys how to navigate that portion um, to sign up for your registration session and pick out your classes, work with your advisor one on one uh, virtually. And uh, now this is, uh, you actually are welcome to actually visit uh, the uh, advising and transfer center. Uh, so you can actually get, you know, some questions answered. You can, you can visit the page which is in the screen. You can actually give them a call. You can email them. We are, I mean, they are there to assist you guys in, you know, answer any questions you might have. Um, Reminder and, that you have to have your placement test done before orientation. So again, um, please know that now we are offering placement test prep sessions um, available through our admissions Zoom chat room. Um, you can see the hours um, and days that they are available. And again, it's one tutor room for English and one for math. Make sure you take the math test at least once before you try to get um, test prep. And English, please, please, please visit the chat room before you take the English test. You can only take it once. Once. 
All right, guys. So this is actually our information. If you guys want to contact us, you know, email us, uh, you know, give us a call. This is our phone number, Veronica, and my my phone number, my information, and this is the uh, the right admissions email so feel free to contact any of us we'll be here to assist you we'll see you guys back in chapter six thank you guys george thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, george. All right.